If you're a heat nourishing technician or even a salesperson, what does compassion and being a human being have to do with your sales process and why does it matter? This is a fantastic question. I'm Scott Sullivan Bell, coming to you live from Waimea Bay, Oahu, on a perfect day to talk about sales and business and a fantastic day to talk about you for HVAC technician sales secrets. Okay, so I got a story to tell. Yesterday, I'm in Holly Eva, and uh, I get a phone call from the people who watch my bird, and they're like, Scott, we've been trying to call you all day. And I go, hey, what's wrong? And they go, we went in this morning to go wake your bird up, and she was at the bottom of the cage. And I'm like, oh, no. Right? I've had this bird for 15 years. She's my favorite bird. She, she's an African gray. She was size of a small chicken. And so I, I get off the phone, and... Uh, I'm not doing well. I'm crying, right? I've had this bird for 15 years. She's my friend. She's my pal. She's my buddy. And I and I get this phone call from uh, from a well-known hotel chain, and I'm crying, right? I'm a grown man crying. Miss my bird, right? I, it still chokes me up even today. And uh, the girl jumps on the phone and she goes, "Hey, this is so and so with this company, and uh, we would like to talk to you about vacation packages." And I, hey, you know, like like right now is not a good time. And you could tell. You could tell when somebody's crying. Like, like if I was crying and you're talking to me on the phone, you can hear it in the voice. And I go, hey, like today's not a, not a good time. I, I would love to hear this conversation. Can you call me back tomorrow? Can you call me back next week? I can't do it right now. And the girl just jumps into like, hey, here's all the good reasons. And you want to go on vacation, don't you? And like in my mind, I'm like, my bird just died. Like literally, I just got off the phone. My bird just died. Like there's no, this couldn't be the worst time. And so the reason that I bring it up is sometimes you need compassion and sometimes you need to be able to go, oh, somebody's having a struggle in their life is it really frustrated me to hear like, hey, let's send you on vacation. Like, like literally, you never know what somebody in, in your business life is going through. And there is time where it's like, okay, I'm not going into a sales pitch. I'm not going into a presentation. I'm going to put this one on hold and I'll come back in a couple of days or I'll come back in a couple of weeks. And this right here is why you should join my email publication. I'll give you the goods, not in the Facebook group, not in the YouTube channel. In my, in my idea, it was a huge mistake on this, this, this person's part, right? Like they've had the training, they've had the coaching. Hey, let's overcome some objections. Like I get it. I work with salespeople. I teach these, these strategies. I teach how to do this. But there's got to be a time where you look around and you're like, all right, you know, I, I completely understand that there's some struggles going on here. I would love to do business with you. I can hear it in your voice. Right now is not a good time. This, this, this girl could not have told me a joke. She couldn't have told me a story. She couldn't have done anything to make me feel better after just hearing that my bird had passed. And the reason I'm sharing this with you, it's super personal to me, super personal to me. The reason I'm sharing this with you is there's gonna be a time where you meet with a buyer. And at the end of the day, it's not a good time for them. At the end of the day, there's something wrong that just happened in their life. Somebody passed away, they lost a pet, they lost some money. And they go, hey, we wanna do business, but can, can you come back? Can, can we do this some other time? Can we make this happen in, in a different location, in a different process? And like the best thing you could do is, yeah, let's, let's, let's connect in the future, right? Not like, hey, I got to close this right now. I've got metrics and I got numbers. I mean, there are legitimate reasons that people are like, not a good time, not a good place. I mean, grown ass dude, I'm 6'2", right? 6'2", 280 pounds, bawling my eyes out at the beach because I lost my bird. The girl's not paying attention. Be aware that a little bit of compassion goes a long ways. I'm not going to hold it against the company. And it it was a good example. Here's the thing. You got one of three things to do from here. Just one of three. Find the subscribe button. Click on it. Every time I send out a video, you'll get an update. Two, hit follow. Three, share this video with a friend. I'll throw in a, a video of my bird talking with me when she was alive. I'll see you soon. Aloha and mahalo.